Leanne Ostermiller, who is a native of Cheyenne, is the sculptor for the Gardens Gone Wild exhibit. He is generous enough to do a great deal and let us exhibit his sculptures for the entire summer. So they'll be here through the, until the end of August. Uh, so everybody who's here for Frontier Days and visiting for the summer can see all these great things. We are also celebrating National Public Gardens Week this week. So um, that's exciting. It's a great way to promote all public gardens in the country. And we also are opening up our gift shop and cafe today. So if you want a lovely place to have lunch, stop by, have coffee. We've got sandwiches, salads, all the things that you can come and enjoy. They're open the same hours that we are open. So it's Tuesday through Saturday from 10 to 5, and then Sunday from 12 to 5. Ursus is the big bear out inside, out in front of the building, and he's so beautiful, and he's my favorite by far. Uh, Lola, the bunny inside, is also pretty fabulous. So it's going to be great to kind of take an adventure through the garden. So there'll be some inside and some outside, and see where you can find them um, amongst their environment in the gardens. I believe there will be 18 in total. Um, there will be some that will be shooting water inside the conservatory, so I have to find those. It'll be great. We'll also have a sculpture kit um, that kids can make their own sculptures that was created by Dan Ostermiller, the artist, as well as his, some of his little sculptures for sale in the gift shop. So um, all of the big ones are for sale. There might be out of some budgets. I know they're out of mine, but if you want a little one, there will be some for sale in the gift shop. I've been doing botanical garden shows. This is the fourth one. And uh, Tina, had known about the the other shows that I did, so she emailed me and asked me if I would be able to come up and talk to him about doing a show here. And I was real excited about it, being from Cheyenne originally, and so I was on it. That's that's always a hard question because you know the concept takes a while to develop and stuff. But I'd say actual working time probably from the clay original all the way to the finished bronze is about between six to nine months. It was in Santa Fe, New at the Santa Fe Botanical Gardens in Santa Fe, New Mexico, and they took it down yesterday. And they took it right from there, loaded it on this truck, and he drove in and arrived this morning, and then we, it took us about three hours to offload. I just hope a lot of people come out and enjoy it and experience it and, uh, uh, you know, People get different experiences than other. Each individual has a different experience with each one. You know, I, I'm, each one of these sort of is a lot of my personality, and I can tell them what I was thinking, but a lot of people look at my work and they it brings something out in them too. And so I just want them to come out and enjoy them and, and experience them in their own way. I didn't know really what, how the garden was developed or even what it looked like until they asked me to come up here and look and I was so shocked because they've done s such a great job and that's typical of Cheyenne. You know, I think the people in Cheyenne, if they want to do something, they really do a good job.